So if you had sort of positive numbers on here, we actually level. If you look, here's a diagram of the fridge, sideways, obviously. So here, here's the top of the fridge and the bottom of the fridge. So <laughs> this is that we're fill, filling from this point. This is the bottom of the duo, filling all this all up here. Yeah. The level meter only goes down to, I think, around here. Uh, I don't see the mark down there, but, um, uh, I can't remember uh, It's around this level, I think, the level meter goes mm -hmm. to. So even though we might have liquid up through here, we won't pick it up until we won't we won't start to pick up the actual level until uh, um, uh, we really get down to pretty low temperatures. I mean, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll already be it'll be in like three hours. Um, okay. Uh, and once we st once we start to get a level, then we know that th this whole this whole chamber is you know close to four Kelvin. Obviously, the stuff for the, what the liquid is is at four Kelvin, and then we can start to transfer pretty quickly. Well, the liquid is going to go up to the the top, right? The liquid will only fill up to about here. So yeah. the low meter, I think I'll see if I can find what it's actually going down here. I mean, my memory is that it's something like here to here. Mm -hmm. And um, it's it's 75, it, the units of that are centimeters. And it goes, so it goes from zero to 75 centimeters. Uh, and so these are these are all millimeters here. So this is, this is, not, this is not a 92 centimeters. So its whole length is something like that. You know, say, I think it's somewhere around here. So, but we'll only fill from here, here up to here. If you fill up here, it's not really worthwhile because, I mean, this is at room temperature, so there's these heat leaks down here. Yeah, yeah. It'll evaporate this all more quickly. But it, it is worthwhile to fill it up uh, as much as we can. On the first transfer, we may actually have enough helium to fill it up all the way. Um, uh, typically, we've been getting up to about 40 centimeters, I think, on first transfer. Mm -hmm. We'll see how mm -hmm. long we do, but we get, we get kind of warm, so. And we have another tank of them. Um, usually, I've been transferring this contention. I transfer up to 75. Centimeters, so that's about good level, look this level. And it takes about three and a half days for it to get down to, to here. Um, yeah. the, uh, the actual, the point actually at which the fridge stops operating fully is also uh, not all the way at the bottom of the level meter, but is around uh, here, I think. Because, remember that 1K pot has a straw which goes down yeah. here. So that's got, the level's got to stay above that straw level. So that's mm -hmm. what's well above where the bottom of the door is. That's about 22 centimeters. So once it gets close to that, if we're running, we want to transfer when it gets down to you know, 25. Do you want to prime this guy? Yeah. The other thing we want to watch is that, um, so they were having problems with the recovery uh, in the other lab. With the recovery line was highly pressurized. So we want to make sure that nothing weird is happening with pressure. So you got a couple of pressure gauges. One is one's here on the tank itself. Not all of these work, but I think this one works well. Um, and the other is on here. This is this is attached to the cover line. And it's about half the psi right now, which is like yeah, yeah it should be. Yeah. So it should be slightly above the uh, pressure. Can you give us uh, like a brief of uh, what's the state right now? Uh, so. Okay, so uh, we, we finished transferring in helium. Uh, we stopped uh, about uh, a couple hours into it when the, uh, the sorb temperature had gotten to 20 degrees uh, below, so we, we put the heater on the sorb mm -hmm. um, to heat it above 20 degrees. And I waited another half an hour or so, and then I pumped out the, uh, the vacuum can with a diffusion pump for half an hour. Mm -hmm. and uh, stopped transferring during that time. And then I uh, uh, sealed up the vacuum pump, started transferring again, and let the sword cool down to below 8 Kelvin. So uh, it's, cool. it's, it's cool, and the sword is pumping on the vacuum can. When we finished transferring, so uh, here's our level up here. We're 44.2 centimeters. It should last about uh, at least a day, 36 hours or so, mm -hmm. we'll see. Okay. Um, and uh, then I just... Um, uh, it's cooled down. The temperature is, the soil temperature is at uh, 6 or 7. The uh, mixing chamber, 5.4, mm -hmm. 1K pot, 5.4. Mm -hmm. uh, I put some, uh, a little bit of healing to the 1K pot at one point just to suck all of it in, not pumping on it uh, to lower the temperature a little bit. But uh, um, uh, I'll just sort of let it sit there and uh, we could we could probably put a little more, uh, I'm going to draw a little more healing there. So put the uh, in one K pot as uh, yeah. some. This is a coolant. As coolant. Yeah. Okay. Um, 
Mm -hmm. how things cool down. So uh, we'll see. What we